My name is Melanie Raynon. I am a dual major of creative writing and journalism. I originally came to Hofstra because I visited the campus and absolutely fell in love with it. Um, I looked at a lot of schools and hadn't really felt like anyone was really focusing on what I wanted. I kind of felt like I was just being put through the motions. And when I visited Hofstra, I had an amazing experience in the Office of Admission here. Everyone really paid attention to my parents and I, what we wanted, kind of helped us through the process and made us feel like we were welcome here. I would say my favorite part of the English major here at Hofstra is that there are different concentrations. Uh, there's so many facets to the English language. It's nice that you have the opportunity to focus on the one that is the most interesting to you, but also explore the other facets as well. Uh, so I focus on creative writing, uh, but I've been able to take literature classes, take publishing classes. Uh, so I've gotten to indulge in everything, but really focus in my love of writing. Um, all of our creative writing classes here are workshop style, so I'm able to bring my work into class, uh, show it to my peers, show it to my professor, and really get the feedback that's going to make my work better in the long run. Uh, here on campus, I'm involved with the Hofstra English Society, which is a fairly new club. We've only been around for a few years. Uh, but really, there was just an absence on this campus for a place to, for people who loved reading and writing and talking about those things to really come together and do that. Uh, so about three years ago now, a student came forth with this idea for the Hofstra English Society, uh, where we would hold weekly writing workshops, where we would host open mic nights, um, semester showcases of student work, but also that we would revive the literary magazine, uh, which was active in the 90s and then kind of disappeared from this campus. Uh, and we were able to bring it back, and in the three years we've been doing it, we've seen hundreds upon hundreds of submissions. Uh, our open mic nights draw in usually about 50 people, uh, and each week our writing workshops give students a place outside the classroom, whether they're English majors or whether they're a biology student who just loves to write, it gives them a place to come where they can share their work with people who are like-minded. Uh, we've created a book blog where students can write book reviews or write little funny listicles about books and reading. Uh, and it's really given, I think, a really strong community to this campus for people who inside or outside the classroom really just love the English language. During my time at Hofstra, I've had three internships. Uh, the first was at a small arts and culture magazine back home in my home state of Rhode Island. Uh, the second internship was at a small web startup in New York City. And most recently, I interned at Adventure Publishing, which is a company that produces toy magazines and does toy reviews for both consumers and industry professionals. Uh, it's a small office. It's a really small team. Uh, and I loved being a part of it. I interned there for a semester and then stayed on as on a freelance basis afterward. And a few weeks ago, I got a call that they're welcoming me back, welcoming me back for after graduation. Uh, so I'm going to have the opportunity to write and edit and do all the things I love, but also play with toys. Uh, so it's a pretty, it's a pretty great first job out of college. I'm about to graduate, so I think the things I'm going to miss most about. Hofstra in general is this beautiful campus. Um, I had class outside just today and I really love that we have the opportunity to take in such a beautiful campus even when we're you know actually in a classroom setting and learning. Um, as far as what the English department's done for me and what I'm gonna miss, I truly truly love being a part of the department. I'm gonna miss coming to class every day and knowing that someone's going to you know see merit in my work and also see where I can improve it. Um, I really learned how to give criticism and receive it in the classes here. Um, and I'm also just going to miss the general community uh, through my classes and also through Hofstra English Society. We're a really close-knit community. Um, we're passionate about the same things and we really foster that on campus. And I'm going to miss having a strong arts community that I can be a part of every single week or every single day if I choose to.